activity-based management. We all know that activity-based management and activity-based costing, ABM or ABC, have brought about radical change in cost management systems. In this lesson, we will discuss activity-based management, describe decision through activity-based management, and state difference between activity-based management and activity-based costing. After going through this presentation, you should be able to explain activity-based management, why organization turn to activity-based techniques, decision through activity-based management, difference between activity-based management and activity-based costing, and output of activity-based management. Activity-based management, ABM, is a method of identifying and evaluating activities that a business performs using activity-based costing to carry out a value chain analysis or a re-engineering initiative to improve strategic and operational decisions in an organization. Activity-based management focuses on managing activities to reduce costs and improve customer value. Operational activity-based management is about doing things right, using ABC information to improve efficiency. Activities that don't add value are the ones that need to be reduced to cut costs without reducing product value. Strategic activity-based management is about doing the right things, using ABC information to decide which products to develop and which activities to use. A risk with ABM is that some activities have an implicit value, not necessarily reflected in a financial value added to any product. Management accounting ABM can give middle managers an understanding of costs to other teams to help them make decisions that benefit the whole organization, not just their activities bottom line. Management practices and methods have changed over the last decade and will continue to change. Organizations are moving from managing vertically to managing horizontally. It is a move from a function orientation to a process orientation. The focus of ABC is on accurate information about the true cost of products, services, processes, activities, distribution channels, customer segments, contracts and projects. Activity-based management makes this cost and operating information useful by providing value analysis, cost drivers and performance measures to initiate, drive or support improvement efforts and to improve decision making. In order to help managers determine the effects of changes in spending patterns and resource allocations throughout the organization, a model must be able to simulate resource levels as a result of process improvement initiatives, product design variation and product mix changes. Activities networks are used to determine the commitment of resources on non-productive processes of the organization. The activity networks are process maps for indirect and other support systems. The advantage of activity networks is that it helps keep managers process oriented. ABM enables the organization to accomplish its outcomes with fewer demands on organizational resources. That is, the organization achieves the same outcomes at a lower total cost. Operational ABM can increase the capacity of resources, equipment and people by reducing machine downtime, improving or even eliminating entirely faulty activities and processes, and increasing the efficiency of the organization's resources. Strategic ABM also encompasses decisions about product design and development where perhaps the biggest opportunity for cost reduction exists. Activity-based costing establishes relationships between overhead costs and activities so that overhead costs can be more precisely allocated to products, services or customer segments. Activity-based management focuses on managing activities to reduce costs and improve customer value. ABC is not a method of costing but a technique for managing the organization better. It is a one-off exercise which measures the cost and performance of activities, resources and the objects which consume them in order to generate more accurate and meaningful information for decision making. ABM draws on ABC to provide management reporting and decision making. 
ABC becomes ABM when it is used to design products and services that meet or exceed customers' expectations and can be produced and delivered at a profit, employ efficient and effective distribution and service processes to target market and customer segments, and improve the value of an organization's products and services. Since activities from the very core of what a business does, the basic output of the ABM system must be to provide relevant cost information about what a business does. Some activities add value to a product or service, while some do not. A non-value added activity is an activity that is considered not to contribute to customer value or to the organization's need. In addition to cost information for business processes and activities, the ABM system must report information and data on activity performance. Knowing the total cost of activity is insufficient to measure activity performance. Products and services are provided to markets and customers through various distribution channels or contractual relationships. Accurate product and service cost information is a key information output of the ABM systems. A cost driver is any factor that causes a change in the cost of an activity. The final output of an ABM system is cost driver information. Now let us check if we have understood the various concepts discussed in this lesson clearly. Activity-based management focuses on managing activities to reduce cost and improve customer value. Right or wrong? Right. A risk with ABM is that some activities have an implicit value not necessarily reflected in a financial value added to any product. Right or wrong? Right. Operational ABM is about doing the right things, using ABC information to decide which products to develop and which activities to use. Right or wrong? Wrong. Before we end, let us briefly revise what we have studied till so far. Activity-based management, ABM, is a method of identifying and evaluating activities that a business performs using activity-based costing to carry out a value chain analysis or a re-engineering initiative to improve strategic and operational decisions in an organization. Activity-based costing establishes relationships between overhead cost and activity so that overhead cost can be more precisely allocated to products, services or customer segments. ABC is a methodology that can yield significant information about cost drivers, activities, resources and performance measures. However, ABM is a discipline that offers the organization the opportunity to improve the value of its products and services. A cost driver is any factor that causes a change in the cost of an activity. Operational ABM is about doing things right, using ABC information to improve efficiency. Strategic ABM is about doing the right things, using ABC information to decide which products to develop and which activities to use.